All right, good morning. Um, we are very pleased to have with us as a guest today, Donnie McKenzie, who is the executive director of the Florida Bar Foundation. Uh, Donnie, welcome. Uh, we're so thankful you could take time out of your schedule to be with us this morning. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the foundation? Uh, thank you, Michael, for allowing me to be here. Um, happy to talk about the foundation. The foundation was created in 1956. It was the creation and the efforts of the Florida Bar and the Florida Supreme Court. Uh, it really came into its own in the late 70s and early 80s, and its mission is to provide greater access to the justice system. It does that through grants programs and initiatives, and it primarily focuses on three types of grants programs and initiatives. The first one is to expand and improve representation and advocacy on behalf of low-income people who can't otherwise afford an attorney. It also uh, tries to find grants and programs and initiatives that improve the fair and effective administration of justice. And lastly, it promotes public service by making public service an integral part of the law school experience. Um, in essence, it uh, its main objective is to protect the institution and the rule of law and to ensure that everyone uh, gets a fair shot and that our legal process is fair and it is applied evenly uh, to everyone. Uh, and that is uh, what we primarily uh, are attempting to do at the Florida Bar Foundation. Oh, okay, thank you very much. Um, and let me segue then into a topic that I know is important to you and the foundation, and that is pro bono service by our members. Can you um, explain why it's important for each of our members and beneficial to each of our members to do pro bono service? Absolutely. I, I think um, first and foremost, uh, it's part of our oath as lawyers. Um, we take an oath uh, and we uh have the luxury of being in a profession. And what a profession does, which is different than a business, is a profession uh, concentrates on being stewards of the community it serves. So we as lawyers have that oath to fulfill uh, that duty, that fiduciary duty to our, our profession and our communities. It's important for clients, obviously, because the objective is to get clients a representation that they otherwise cannot afford. And also, I think it is an excellent, excellent opportunity for young lawyers. Um, you and I recall being young lawyers um, to hone your skills. Uh, as a long, young lawyer, especially when in the law firms that we came up in, and we were fortunate to work with a, a large and prestigious law firm, you don't get too many opportunities to get real-time experience with clients earlier in your career. So if you take on a pro bono case, I've always told folks, it allows you to hone your skills. Uh, it allows you to expand your reputation, your experience base. And we all know that in this profession, experience and reputation are the real currency of our profession. So pro bono is an important aspect of carrying out our duty, uh, and it also is an excellent opportunity for young lawyers to gain experience uh, and uh, gain valuable work experience uh, helping clients and helping themselves. And then um, on that topic of, of doing pro bono service, um, can you tell us about the One Promise campaign that the foundation now has underway? Certainly. Um, the One Promise campaign is a revival of the One campaign that we launched back in 2009. And in 2009, we were able to uh, move the needle by 14 points by simply asking and encouraging lawyers to consider taking one case. And so it, uh, the One Promise campaign is our attempt to revive that. It is a collaborative effort, um, starting with Gary Jordan, who uh, is a eight-time Emmy Award uh, winning producer who has given his time for free. Uh, it is um, uh, paid for, the production costs were paid for by um, various bar sections, various uh, voluntary bar associations, uh, and uh, various uh, committees have helped us 
uh, stream out this campaign. Um, it, it, again, is an effort to simply um, convince people, uh, all lawyers, young lawyers, old lawyers, older lawyers, retired lawyers, about the importance and the ease of taking on a pro bono case. Uh, if you take on a case, uh, you'll make a difference. And that, in essence, is our one promise campaign. It's on our website. Uh, so if you simply go to our website, you'll see where we have um, uh, advertised the rollout of the One Promise campaign, and we're really excited about it. And, and if I understand the title of the campaign or the name of it, One Promise, the goal there is to have each of our members take one case. Is that right? Yeah, exactly. It's one lawyer, one client, one promise. Wouldn't that be wonderful if each one of our 110,000 members took one case? It would be phenomenal. It would make a significant difference in, uh, in our efforts to increase access to our justice system. All right, Donnie, thank you very much for joining us and in, uh, in giving us this information uh, on the foundation and on the One Promise campaign. And I wish you the best with that campaign. Thank you, Michael. And if, uh, if anyone ever needs anything from the Florida Bar Foundation, simply call us. My cell phone is on the website and our website is open for all and you there are plenty of links and plenty of things that we're doing and if you need help with anything we're happy to help, happy to assist and happy to help you point you in the right direction all right thank you thank you mike this has been at the mic with mike